to be easing a little bit. Frank Lowen hitting it up there well. Richie Mullally, great take. Nicely down here towards Henry Shefflin. What a battle he's going to have with Sean McMahon. It's starting already. Thundering forward, looking for the opening score. It's a goal! Beautiful across ball. Henry Shefflin got across and DJ just tapped it down into the net. What a start that is. DJ Carey with yet another championship goal. It was this marvellous run here by Henry Shefflin. Getting away there from Sean McMahon. And a little touching, delightfully done by DJ Carey. The master strikes. Good cut. Going back there was John Redden that time. Couldn't take it. Instead away comes Martin Comerford. Jersey pulled. Still manages to get the space at the time to strike it and put it over the bar. Well, Gilligan was trying to get that ball forward into the corner there towards Tony Griffin. No such luck. Richie Mullally out here into the centre. Derek Ling, the familiar style, the style we've become very accustomed to this year. Here is Henry Shefflin. Shefflin scores! But it's over the bar. Thought he was going to bury it. Fantastic save by David Fitz. That could be in the back of the net. Shefflin is cutting down the middle, getting on the brakes. Great, great save. Well, full credit to Davy Fitzgerald. Watch it again here. Shefflin bearing in on goal. He had support, didn't need it. But that's a flashing save there by Fitzgerald to put it over the bar and prevent a certain goal for Kilkenny. Well, Kilkenny scoring chances so far. 13. Clare scoring chances, 10. And you can see Kilkenny have taken 12 of their 13 scoring opportunities. Wonderful record. Clare coming again. They need a goal! They get a point instead. They took a very fast sideline ball there. The Kilkenny backs were caught napping. That could have been in the back of the net. Once again problems presenting themselves. Brian Lowen chasing after Martin Comerford. Outside for Andy Comerford, his brother. Colin Lynch after him. Can he get the ball in? Can't succeed. And it's Frank Lowen who thunders out of there. Trying to give a bit of leadership. Trying to rally the troops. David Ford, clear needing scores. In towards Markham this time. In on the blind side of Philly Larkin. He's put it wide. Yeah, there was a chance there, like the ball broke turn, and that hit the back of the net to bring clear back into it. Well, it was a good chance. Baker, the last one he drove outside and wide. He's trying, trying to tee it up for somebody. And that somebody on this case is Tony Carmody. Trying to round Noel Hickey, succeeding. A chance for Clare here. Carmody. Down he goes. Referee says play on, and Philly Larkin is at the end of the movement to sweep it back out the field once again. The right position at the right time, and the right man as well. Larkin, this time it's Markham, it comes off Larkin, it's gone for a 65. It's all clear to her at the moment, they're really putting the pressure on, but if they could get a few scores from the such. Four points so far, all long-range frees. It's well-directed, it's on target, and it's another point. They're going to have a game now, Joe. He's Clare's leading scorer, and there's a goal between them. Can Kilkenny gain from this here? Sean McMahon was rising up for that one. And ball, I think, in the end, will be thrown in by the referee. Ollie Baker is there to contest with John Hoyne. And that is a point. It's scored by Henry Shefflin. Who else? Everybody going up for that one. It's John Hoyne who's trapped it through the center. DJ Carey, the Dodger himself. After him there was Ollie Baker. DJ steadying himself, turning it in beautifully and putting it over the bar. And he's now got a goal and four points. That's a fantastic score, Jerry. Couldn't catch it again yet, taking it twice to his hand. And he's a genius no matter what to say. You just won't replace this fight. But here is Brian Lowen. One man who never lets the side down. Not a great pass. Brian McAvoy. First touch, first chance. Anxious to make an impact, and he does it instantly. 
Great point by Brian McAvoy. Peter Barry scooping it away neatly. Out to Richie Mullally. Good combined play. But again, it's Comerford on to Brian McAvoy. Just looking around, picking out Charlie Carter. He'd love to score. Can he do so now? He can. I'm sure he'll say that will do very nicely indeed. That was a, a very fine point by Charlie Carter. Back there is Brian Lowen, partly blocked. Swept inside, dangerous ball. Shefflin! Henry Shefflin, 28 minutes gone in the second half. And that should be enough to secure the title for the Cats. That's a goal and seven points now for Henry Shefflin. Martin Comerford played it across the face of the goal. Lovely, well-timed run. And Shefflin buries it in past Davy Fitzgerald, who's beaten for the second time in the game. Good goal by Shefflin. Hard to see any way back this, at this stage. Sean McMahon still giving it everything. And he has rifled it over the bar. Of the Clare full forward line that started, only now Gilligan managed to score. He got two points. Once again, it's DJ Carey. The referee is calling for the ball. It's all over. Kilkenny are very deserving champions. Champions for the 27th time. The Liam McCarthy Cup is going down with Andy Comerford and his pals. They have done it all. It's someday deserved winners. No doubt about that. And Brian Cody is entitled to his little dance, and they'll be dancing all over Kilkenny. We got a fabulous cushion early on. We got a goal from DJ. And you know, that was important because. After half time, the pressure we were put under was phenomenal by Clare. We knew they were going to come, we knew they were going to be a, a massive storm to weather. We weathered it, we held on, we fought, we dug in, we, we, we weathered it eventually, and then we started to hurl again. You know, it's the result is everything now, Marty, you know. The game is won, we're all Ireland champions, and it's fabulous. Kilkenny, the champions, for the 27th time ever.